National Kidney Month, and it's a good time to learn more about chronic kidney disease, your risk factors, and check in on your health. Savannah Harrison spoke with doctors about what you need to know. Good morning, Savannah. Good morning, Lauren. Now, kidneys are crucial to filtering toxins and waste out of the blood. And I spoke with doctors at Cox Health on um, why it's so important to make sure you're keeping your kidneys healthy. Now, your most common causes for chronic kidney disease include diabetes and high blood pressure. Those can put strain on your kidneys, so it's important to do what you can to take care of them. If you have these conditions, make sure you're mitigating them well with correct medications. Other things you can do to protect your kidneys include drinking a lot of water, maintaining a healthy lifestyle, and avoiding in said medications like ibuprofen and Aleve. Doctors tell me one of the best things you can do to preserve kidney function is be proactive in your care. Educate yourself, know your risk factors, and visit your doctor regularly to have your kidneys checked. If, if either the primary care physician can can maybe go over the fact that, hey, you're, this is what I'm looking at is your creatinine value. And, you know, it's looking really good right now. Your urinalysis didn't show any protein in the urine and everything is looking good. It would be helpful to, to for the patient to know, oh, okay, so that every time they see their, all their labs, there's all these numbers, and it can be quite confusing, and I understand that, but, you know, if, if they know, you know, oh, my kidneys are okay, well, now I know why my kidneys are okay, here's the numbers that show it. Now, chronic kidney disease progresses in five stages, and while it is possible to heal your kidneys a little bit, it's still important to take care of them. Chronic kidney disease can cause things such as bone decay, fatigue, weight loss, even causing up to dialysis. Reporting live in Springfield, Savannah Harrison, KY3 News.